welcome back to my channel i am felicity if you're new what's up what it is what it do and if you're a return subscriber hey girl hey and if you're new what's up what it is what it do what's tea what's good sweetie <laughs> hey y'all it is january the 18th 2022 and baby it is tuesday my kids are out of school um they've been out of school since um thursday and so y'all they go back to school tomorrow supposedly go back to school tomorrow so this morning i am up and i was like let me just vlog baby let me vlog let me let me give y'all something let me let me give y'all something because today was one of them days where i woke up this morning and i ain't even gonna really say been worried y'all I won't say I've been worried. Oh, I probably came in here a little strong this morning. I probably came a little strong with this video, but um, while I'm sitting here watching this pot out because I didn't watch it last night, don't judge me. Don't judge me. But um, yeah, while I'm sitting here just thinking, and I woke up this morning, I prayed and I talked to God. And um, yeah, I told y'all that lately, it just been like here for real. The way I've been feeling, I got this feeling inside me well I know it's somebody in me that's ready to come and what I start with her I don't know what I do with her I don't know but I do know that it's getting ready to go to another place in my life that I've never been and it doesn't matter how nobody else feel. It, it doesn't matter what you think. It doesn't matter how you feel. It doesn't matter what you think that I should be doing. It doesn't matter how you feel that I should be doing. Don't project your fears. Don't project what you think. Don't project how you feel on me. That ain't got nothing to do with me. Y'all, I'm at this point in my life right now. Today was that day where, like, it's some things right now in my life that is that that i just be and i ain't gonna yeah i'm gonna say a need because you know i talked to y'all about like um oh well i ain't doing this and i ain't got this and i ain't doing it and i ain't doing this you know what i'm saying i be so transparent with y'all because i know i ain't the only person out here in this world that feel like felicity feel it just be somebody like me don't mind sharing my experiences it's somebody like me out here that don't mind letting y'all know that if you trust God, man, God will provide every freaking thing for you. He'll provide every, man, God will provide everything for you. And when I tell y'all stuff like this, I really hope that if it's any single mom, because I talk to a single mama, and I only speak from a single mama because I'm her. I'm that voice, I got to be that voice for y'all, because baby, I know how it feels. I know what it feels like. I know what it feels like. To be in the spot where you literally ain't got nobody, just you and God. You gotta take care of kids. It's bills are due. Things are happening around you. Y'all, I had made a snap the other day, and I was just telling God like, I gotta trust. You. Like I have to trust God in moments when I be feeling so undefeated. This morning I woke up, y'all. I had this feeling where it's just like, God, okay, it's some stuff that needs to be paid today. And I just woke up, you know, I'm just like, you know what? If it gotta go, we gotta go. Because I've been asking God for some news for so long. And if this that reason for it to get gone, for I can get my new, let's take it, let's get it. Like, I am willing to lose it because I know it's a game out there. Like, I, I don't mind losing it because I know God got something so much bigger. If it, if it calls for me losing it, I know God got something bigger for me. Like, if it, if it takes for God to take it from me, then I know it's something bigger for it. And I just got to trust God in moments when I feel so freaking undefeated, man. And I just want that single mama to know, baby, I promise you, I understand. I get it. I I understand. I get so tired of trying to be that person. Of, you know, this has been my big problem, y'all. Because I always try, people always don't portray me to have that girl with the attitude and excuse my um trash right here too y'all because um oh my god i did not mean to be crying but excuse my trash y'all gotta take it out but um let me set y'all up so 
I always be the girl with they you they they always be like um my attitude they always felt like I just had a bad attitude you know what I'm saying like and I ain't gonna act like I ain't her because I'm telling you I'm her and when I say my mouth I it ain't even my attitude it just be like I don't like to be played with because I'm a very respectful genuine kind pure-hearted person that don't mind giving that don't mind doing but do not play with me because I'm her. And I say that respectfully, but I'm her. And I and you know, if people betray you to be so mean because you ain't like everybody else or because you so quiet and you just, and you will snap. And, and you, that ain't even me. It's not me, it's in me, but that ain't me. I can't go, like how I used to be back in the day with just the, 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 the straight snap on you. I ain't like that today, okay? Because uh i really just can't give that much time to nobody and people no more you know what i'm saying like i just can't give that much time to you so now i be going around like another way because i be like you know i need this is bigger than you it's deeper than you and you just cannot get yourself to that point but is it inside me it's stuff i promise you it's the like playing with me and you fooling over me or messing over me you you have to realize and honestly believe like dang she really must think i'm dead because I look over you like, you play over me one time. You would think I hate you because I don't play like that. I don't play like that. I'm a, I'm a respectful person. I'm a genuine person. I'm a pure hearted person. And I'm one of them people that, you know what I'm saying? People portray you to be that because of just the way you is, the way you move and your presence alone and how they feel. That ain't got nothing to do with me. Take it up between you and God. But I'm at this point in my life right now, y'all. I woke up this morning, I'm just like, you know what, God? Especially with my car, because I, I want to be so transparent with y'all people. Because listen here, let me let me tell y'all single mama something. Single fathers, single people. If you got children out here and you trying to do it all by yourself, and you in that place where you just don't know. Listen here, I told y'all, God gave me YouTube. God gave me YouTube because God knew that this is something that I can take. I genuinely love getting on this camera. I genuinely love doing it. This is what I want to do. I genuinely want to do YouTube. I love YouTube. I want to get a lot more things with it because I genuinely love this. I genuinely love it. Like, I love doing it. Now, I'm just trying to get this point where it's just like, God, what season am I in? What's my purpose? What am I supposed to be still doing? Or what am I supposed to be doing while I'm still here? How am I supposed to be serving you? How am I supposed to be helping somebody else? What, what, and I say, what is my gift? Because I ask always, all the time, be like, what is my gift? And then I be knowing it's always, I got that gift of talking to people. I have that gift of encouraging somebody else. I have that gift of joy. I have that gift of peace. I have that gift of just being able to listen to somebody. I have that gift of encouragement to somebody else because, baby, I wish I had what I give. I wish I had what I give. I wish I had people that can pour that type of things that I pour into somebody else's life into mine. Like, I know what it's like. So, I'm going to tell y'all single mom, single, and I say I speak for a single mom because, baby, I understand. I tell y'all this here. When I tell y'all I understand, I want to be so transparent with y'all today because I don't, I don't want nobody ever get that, that thought of like, oh, she got this going on and she got that going on and she good and she straight. Baby, I have to sit here and talk to God all the time. Like, I literally cried yesterday. I cried the other day. Like, it was something that, had to, that got took the other day. And when it got took, I wasn't even, I wasn't even in, in that moment. I, I did it. But afterwards, I cried and I talked to God because I'm just like, God, like I'm still in that same spot. Which is all right, you know what I'm saying? Because I know that God is so much bigger than the things that we sit around here and stress about. Like, the things that I sit around here and be like, oh, well, God, I feel like I need this. and Oh, well, God, I feel like I need that. Or, oh, I want this and I want that. You know what? God, take whatever you do that's not of you and the things that I feel like I need. And give me the things that you want me to have. The things that's of you. Not my will, God, your will. And use me in a way to where it's like my gift will make room for me. I mean that spot where I don't got to worry about how a bill going to get paid. Because this gift going to make room for Felicity. This gift is going to... I always have been saying it for the longest. I know my gift going to open some doors. I know my gift is going to put me in a room with people. My gift is going to put me in a place where I won't have to ever ask nobody for it. I won't ever have to beg... I won't ever have to give no stuff to where I won't have to ask 
borrow, beg, ask nobody for nothing because God is my provider. And I, and I guess people don't understand it. People don't understand it. Like, baby, how you ain't that deep? You ain't that deep. You ain't that deep. And if it calls for me doing something that I want to do or I feel like that's best for me and my kids, and you feel like, oh, well, it ain't, and you can't help me or you can't do something for me, that fine too that that's fine too i'm perfectly fine with that because i know god got me and my children like god got felicity and her kids i have to always believe god got me and my babies god got me and my babies he will not leave me he will not forsake me he got me and my kids god really love me man i am special I am a special type of person. I am a special type of girl. It is somebody that's out here praying and wanting and, and needing somebody like me in their life. It's And I'm praying for them people that God connect me with the right people at the right time and at the right place. So I encourage any other mom, any other person out here just want to try to get something right and trying to do something right for you and your baby. And whether it look like it ain't happening right now, baby, make, make the vision, make it plain. And, and when it's hairy, and, and how long you have to wait in the endurance of it, baby, it's going to come. It's going to come. It's going to come. Find the thing that God has you to do. Chase God. God give you what you want. God gives you what you need. Get, get, get that relationship with God. Get that connection with God. Get that relationship with God. Because I'm going to tell y'all right now, sometimes I get a little weird. Sometimes I just be like, I don't know. What am I here doing? I, I, I honestly tell God all the time, like, I need help. Because... I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> when I tell y'all I literally don't know what I'm doing out here. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm really out here winging it. When I tell y'all winging it, baby, I'm winging it for real. Like, I'm out here winging it. I am winging it. <clears throat> I don't know. My next move, I don't know. What I supposed to be doing, I don't know, girl. I be up here having to talk to God. Like, God, what am I doing? What am I supposed to be doing? What am I? And I know it's something still here because Felicity is still here. He ain't done, excuse my hair, he ain't done with me yet. How I know he ain't done with me yet? Because guess who he'll still talk to you? So I know it's some more up in me. I know it's something that's, it's something up in Felicity that the world needs. It's something in me that somebody needs. It is something up in me that God needs to get from me to get out to somebody else. I'm a teacher from here and on out. I am a lender and not a borrower. I am the head and not the tail. I am above and not beneath. I am somebody. I am somebody. I just want y'all to know, if y'all in this spot where I'm at and you're trying to figure this out and you don't know what to do, you don't, you don't know how to do it, I pray for genuine, real connections, people that's supposed to help me to my destiny. I pray that God connect me with the right people at the right time and at the right place. I pray that God put me in a position where I just won't ever have to ask nobody. I won't have to beg nobody. I won't have to ever ask nobody to give and, hey, could you do? I, I don't, I don't want to have to ask that because I know God is the source of my, the, God is my provider. God is the person that can help me. God is the person that gives me the things that Felicity needs. And at this point in my life, y'all, I'm just, I, 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 I just don't know. And I'm coming to y'all today because I don't know. And I just wanted to give y'all the video today because I this is where I'm at in my walk right now. And I don't want y'all to be feeling bad for the way you at in your life, baby. Don't ever feel bad for the way you at in your life. Don't feel bad for where you at in your life. It's your journey. It's your journey. It's your story. This your story. This is what God having you to do. So if it calls for me to do anything, y'all, I promise y'all where I'm at right now. Baby, get to God if you got to go get it. If it, if it got to go get it. If, if, it, if you need it, get it. If you got to take it, get it. If you got to do whatever you need to do to get whatever you need to get, have it. H have it. Period, cause I'm at I'm at that place, y'all. I just I just refuse to sit here and worry about things. I just refuse to be putting myself in a position to be worrying about certain little things. I just can't. I refuse to worry. I'm not worrying no more. I'm not worrying no more. I'm not worrying no more. I'm not stressing no more. I'm not fearing no more. All of that gotta go. It, that's all gotta go. What we gonna do?
What we got? What we gonna do? What's the solution? How 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 can I help me? How can I put me in a position? Cause I got some ideas. I got the plan. I just need the platform. <laughs> I just need the platform. I got the plan. I got the plan. Cause I got plenty of them. When I tell you, baby, Felicity got some ideas. Felicity got some ideas. And the thing is, it's like God done gave me some couple dreams. God done gave me a couple visions. God done gave me some things, and it's just like I don't know where to start it. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to do it. I don't got the resources. I don't got the connections. I don't got nothing. Literally just some faith. That's how I feel this guy right here. So when y'all see me like this, don't think it's just nothing, baby. It's faith. I strictly speak on this camera because it's faith. I get myself on this camera to sit here and talk to y'all because it's faith. It's faith. So just on my camera, y'all, today, I just want to encourage y'all to keep going. I encourage y'all to don't lose the faith. I encourage y'all, y'all. I told y'all I don't be wanting to cry with y'all. I really don't be wanting to cry with y'all because literally when I be on Snapchat, I cry a lot. I ain't a big crybaby. And I think because of all I've been through, man, I still keep the hope. And I still keep the faith. I still keep the faith. And all you need is a... It's a mustard seed. It's a mustard seed. And my face is so much bigger than that. And it's so crazy because people be really inspired by me. And I never thought, I never would have thought that people really be looking at me as some inspiration. Never would have thought that people look at me as the inspiration. So for people to just think that I'm just this girl to be out here like, oh, I'm I'm good, I'm straight, I'm I'm not. Y'all look at Jace. He hear me crying, y'all. So he in here. But I just encourage y'all to listen to him. Keep going, man. Keep going, and I know. And like this ain't even that time for us to be sitting around here stopping. It's go time. Like it's we can't stop in these moments. These these times with somebody. I hear that need these, the, somebody out here need these encouragement words that I be giving somebody. Like, somebody be needing to hear it from another single mom because I'm telling y'all, I know what it feels like, man. When I tell y'all I know what it feels, I know what it feels like to be broke. I know what it feels like to have to sit here and brew some water on the stove so you and your kids can take a bath. I know what it feels like to open this old oven so we can keep it, keep it warm in here because my heat was off. I know what it feels like to be in a spot where I got to warm water so I can wash dishes. I know what it feels like to put some dish detergent in the water because I don't got no dish detergent. I know what it feels like, baby, I know what it feels like have to just sit here and strap the, the soap because we ain't got no money. I don't have the money enough to go even buy no soap. I know what it feels like to not have no gas in your car because I just ain't got the money to put it in there. I know what it feels like to not have a piece of food in your refrigerator, baby. I know what it feels like. I know what it feels like. So I want to encourage y'all to keep going, man. Keep freaking going, mama. Keep freaking going, mama. It's okay. It's okay. And I speak to y'all because I talk to Felicity. And I'm so passionate about talking to y'all because I speak for me. I speak for me. And it ain't happy yet. It ain't freaking happy yet. It ain't happy yet. God ain't gave it to me yet, but I know my time coming. I know God is about to bless me. Ten times more. And for the ones that ever done me wrong, thank you so much. For y'all that ever done put y'all mouth on me, thank y'all so much. For y'all that ever done doubt on me, thank you so much. For y'all that ever be like, oh, you don't fool me no more. Don't ever be thinking it's beef, though, baby. Don't ever think it's beef because it, when it's a, a boundary and it's, it's not none of that connection with me and you like that no more, please don't ever think it's no beef. Never think it's beef. Because I promise you I ain't mad. I just learned how to, you know, put my stuff to the side, but don't ever think it's no beef, baby. But I still I always wish you the best because I don't wish bad on nobody. I don't wish bad on nobody, baby. I want God to bless you. I want him to let you eat. I want all y'all to eat, but just won't be eating with Felicity. It just won't be eating with Felicity. So I just want to encourage any mama out here today. Baby, keep going. It is Tuesday. I love y'all so much. I did not mean to get on this camera and be crying like this. 
But baby, today was the day it had to come out. And I'm not going to edit this video. I'm just going to go on ahead and put it out. Because God wanted me to come to y'all like this today. And today is the day where it's another time, y'all. It's a new season. It's season is here. It's harvest time. Get everything that's in this season for you and your babies, for you and your children, for you and yourself. God, the things God wants you to have, the things God you desire. Um... He going to open doors, opportunities. I'm really praying that God put me in a space where it's opportunities and doors and, and that place where I never would have thought. I never would have thought. I, I, I'm ready for God to put me in a place where I never would have thought that I could be in or sit with people that I never I look up to. You know what I'm saying? Like, never would have thought. So, I just want to encourage y'all to keep going today. I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for even watching my video. I know it's short today, but I love y'all so much. Please come in, like, and subscribe. And don't you dare let nobody miss up y'all day. Don't dare let nobody miss up y'all day. Have a great and awesome day. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Yo!